Assalamu alaikum my dear students how are you hope all of you are well by the grace of almighty Allah welcome to ANI EBS home school this is Shata the actor assistant teacher of science of national ideal English version school Deji today I am going to take an elementary science class for class 5 students my dear students our today's topic is chapter 3 short question answer our today's lecture number 11 and SW number also 11 my dear students let's start our class this is chapter 3 <coughs> short question today we'll discuss um, uh, short question um, from this chapter short question number one what is the water cycle the way that water moves all around the earth as it's uh, as it changes its state is called the water cycle i repeat the way the water moves all around the earth as it changes changes its state is called the water cycle short question number two give three examples of how we can prevent water <coughs> pollution we can prevent water pollution by reducing the use of pesticides and chemical fertilizer in agriculture should not throw chemicals and oils down the sink drain or the toilets and by picking up trash uh, at the beach river or canal now come to short question number three give four ways to get safe water from unsafe fresh water the four ways that shows to get uh, safe water from unsafe water are filtration sedimentation boiling and purifying water with chemical question number short question number four write down the two reasons of water pollution <coughs> the two reasons of water pollution are given below number one water pollution is caused by insecticides and number two water pollution is caused by chemicals from factories short question number five write the two impacts of water pollution on environment <clears throat> two impacts of water pollution on environment are given below number one water pollution can cause death of aquatic animals and disruption of food chains in water number two human is also affected by water pollution such as skin disease and waterborne disease like diarrhea or cholera short question number six write down two ways of water purification <coughs> two ways of water purification are filtration and sedimentation short question number seven what is arsenic arsenic is a poison which contaminated water arsenic is a poison which contaminated water come to short question number eight after rain there is a puddle on the ground after a short time the puddle of water disappears where has the water gone after rainfall either the puddle of the water is absorbed <coughs> into the ground or run off into river flows to see where it evaporates back into the air short question number nine what are the three states of water the three states of water are solid liquid and water vapor short question number 10 what is water purification water purification is a process that makes water safe and drinkable for human short question number 11 how are clouds formed water evaporates from ocean and rivers rises in air then it cools and condenses into tiny droplets which accumulate to form cloud short question number 12 what is dew the drops of water that form on cool surfaces such as grass and leaves at night are called dew short question number 13 what is condensation water vapor in the air is changed into water by cooling the change of state from a gas to liquid is called condensation short question number 14 what is evaporation when water is heated it changes into water vapor the change of state from a liquid to gas is called evaporation short question number 15 how will you get safe water from ponds water water which does not contain dust and germs of diseases is safe water we get safe water from ponds water by filtration sedimentation boiling and purifying water with chemical short question number 16 write two chemicals name which is used to purify water what will become if enough amount of heat is removed from water the names of two chemicals that used in water purification are alum and bleaching powder solid water that is ice will be formed if enough amount heat is removed from water my dear students your today's sw number is 11 
and short question number 1, 5 and 16 is your SW and submit it on Saturday my dear students I am telling again number 1, 5 and 16 is your SW my dear students I hope all of you have understood our today's topic learn properly all short question see you again in the next class Allah Hafiz